what is your party's vision for a national anti-racism strategy? Will you support strengthening of the anti-racism secretariat to make it more impactful, relevant, and sustainable? How will you ensure that racialized Canadians are engaged in your activities to address racism in Canada? We'll start at the end of the Thank you. Racism has uh, so, so many different aspects. Um, let's just talk about jobs. Um, we now have seen research coming out of the University, University of Toronto where, um, depending on uh, the name you put in your resume or how it was you apply, that there is what that there is still employment discrimination. Um, so part of uh, what the, um, the, new Democratic, the new Democratic Party has come out is um, with an anti-racism uh, secretariat is to have uh, a study on federal public service jobs and federally regulated industries and looking at what uh, what, uh, and what, the, what, what, what the racialized wage gap and the employment equity situation that's, at least that's how the federal government has control. We know that, that Ford has drastically reduced funding on the provincial anti-racism uh, secretary. That's just one aspect. And another aspect is uh, data collection. We remember the Stephen Harper government, they wanted to reduce uh, the scope of Statistics Canada and even do normal 10-year, every 10-year census. And so, uh, that would be uh, what the NDP and what my focus is, is on, on anti-racism secretary work on collecting data and seeing uh, where things uh, are and how things um, uh, are trending. Um, one other thing that uh, Jagmeet Singh uh, has come out is to ban card. That is, uh, no matter what happening, the new government and the new government has, has, has promised, well, it's still happening. And that actually affects a lot of residents in this right. Um, okay, thumbs up.
more support for this initiative, even within the very party that developed it. This was clearly de demonstrated by Justin Trudeau's uh, mass actions this last week with the blackface and, and brown face. Please stop. Things. So when your own leader, the Prime Minister of Canada, preaches intolerance to racism and suggests otherwise, that he's not on board, you have lost all credibility with any anti-racist initiative. Once elected, I will represent our diverse community in Ottawa, having learned from those mistakes from last week. I will ensure all stakeholders in our community are active, not passive participants, in any consultations leading to the release of a better and more sustainable policy on anti-racism that really takes into account our diversity here at Scarborough Park. Thank you. Thank you. 